they so they once again acknowledge on screen the relationship between uh, Brie and Daniel Bryan. Besides the beautiful, beautiful, amazing, heartwarming, tender moment last week that I thoroughly enjoyed. Agreed. This was this was like the first like saying it, just flat out saying it. Right. By the way, uh, so the like whole that was like the subtle thing, and now here's the kind of you know. So the, the the AJ pipe bomb a few weeks ago was the, was the whole point of that just to get all of the total divas on the same page so that like instead of having them bickering on WWE TV but then have them like doing whatever they do on total divas was it was this like a ploy to make them all collectively the total divas Yeah, I think it was uh it was all just to let it like if the show is going to be completely kayfabe, I guess they had to like follow suit and let it translate into the show as well, into the, you know raw and everything as well. Yeah, to the programming. So I I underst- I, I I totally agree with it. I if I was you know behind everything and orchestrating that and making the diva show, I probably would have said to go do that as well. It makes sense. All right, so that's that. But real quick, is Brie Bella her face now? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Like are, are, by like default with being with the bride because like. When I, she tagged, when she tagged with them, like the last few weeks, she's kind of, you know, the Bellas are still kind of heels, even though they're with the Total Divas. This week, they seem like legit on the same page, like they wanted to be do all together. Here's the, yeah, here's here's what I think was supposed to happen. I think the WWE thought if they sent AJ out out there and she just crapped all over the Total Divas thing, that the crowd would boo her more. And then sympathize with the total divas, and I think the backlash that they weren't expecting was that everybody was going to agree with AJ <laughs> and dislike the total divas as much as possible. I don't, I don't think they thought that through, and I think it was a byproduct of the promo and not actually what the intention was. I have to slightly disagree with you. Okay, what's your slight disagreement? I think. After having the CM Punk pipe bomb go down where he's supposed to be a heel and then just vent, and if they do a likewise thing where they give her the mic, he'd be like, hey, just talk about, you know, whatever you want. Like, you know, like, talk about who you are and, like, you know, in relation to the other divas and how you feel about the whole division. And I think they had to know that, like, the pure wrestling fans or, you know, the people are going to get behind what she's saying that, you know, because it, it's – Plain as day that most of those other girls, they're just not that good besides, like, uh, Nightheart. I think they're apples and oranges a little bit, though, because... When it comes to wrestling. CM Punk was venting about everything, pretty much, and she was just more or less attacking the Total Divas, which encompassed a little bit more, um, categorically, like, a more robust variety of things, but she was basically saying to the Total Divas that, you know, this show is stupid, you're all glorified models, and, you know, and, and you know, Natty Nightheart, she doesn't really, she's not, like, just these beauty queens that end up becoming wrestlers, like, she's a legit wrestler, but I just, I think it just backfired a little bit on them. No, yeah, all right, I mean, it's up to interpretation, but... Well, let's, let's have... Let's can have... we agree... Can we agree that it at least is making the Divas division a little bit more interesting is, for once? But Spurge, yeah. Spurge, what do you think? No, I'm I'm with you. I, I think that too. And I, I think it's it's probably it's not even just what AJ said for like the real wrestling fans, it's just because she delivered it so well. Right. And that's what it was. So we all, you know, kind of connected with that too. So, you know, I'm with you. 